Hey YouTube, this video will show you guys how to create a bootable USB with uh, Ubuntu on it or any Linux distribution on it for that matter on uh, you doing it actually through Ubuntu itself. So uh, what you do need to start off with is a bit of software called uh, UNet Bootin, which I'll actually just quickly show you all how to install. So you would firstly go to a terminal and type in the following command, sudo apt install UNet Bootin and let's just do w uh, or dash y for a faster installation there throw in your password allow that to complete and there you go great now i'll show you the actual software itself so let's go into just type unet boot in there as we can already see it there anyway so let's click on that one now it will ask you for your password for this type of software because it is it can be dangerous if not used correctly so here we are, so it's uh, fairly simple but uh, still fairly effective and powerful. So let's just say you want to uh, install Ubuntu and go for the most recent uh, daily live or if we could at least 5.15 or 16, which I can't seem to find there, that's okay. We can uh, pretty much yeah, use that, select that there. Most of the time, however, I like to use the disk image instead, so the ISO and uh, then select where that comes from in the downloads folder, ISOs, here we go, 16.04 Ubuntu desktop. So click on that one, there we go. Now the last most important part is selecting the USB disk. So let's just say, uh, mine's already showing up there, mine's already plugged in, as yours might be as well. The last thing you want to do is click hard disk. And there's very little reason for this to be here in the first place. I'm sure I can you know, think of a reason or two, but um, very dangerous, only use USB drive and you'll see a list of one or two depending on how many you have in there. So I won't exactly give you the name, but I do know for a fact that this is my Sony 8 here. It's the only USB I've got uh, plugged in. So from that point, uh, bada bing, bada boom, bada bang. Click OK and start to, uh, yeah, set it up. Override, I've already got something on there, but yeah, let's override it and off you go. So that is all uh, download into this USB disk here. Now, once that's done, I can uh, boot this up to this computer, maybe another desktop, anything, and uh, have it boot up a live copy of Ubuntu 16.04, uh, as we can see it there. So that's pretty much it in a nutshell, guys. Uh, that is how you install the UNet Bootin application that is used to create uh, pretty much, uh, yeah, USB copies to, to uh, bootable USB drives for Linux or pretty much any distribution for that matter, possibly even Windows. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Hope you've enjoyed.